nine in our series, taking you from beginner to a power user in ACDC Photo Studio Ultimate. One of the things that we wanna do after we've processed all our images is we wanna share them with people. And there's a lot of places that sending by email can go wrong or online sharing systems can go wrong. I was gonna, sh I wanna show you two, two different ways that we can share images right out of ACDC. These are built in. So I'm gonna grab these two photos I took of my daughter's car. We restored a VW and I want to send those out. So I can right click on those, click send and email images. It's gonna give me a pop-up for the email wizard. Now, before I go in and just hit send, I wanna go in and suggest to you that you wanna click on options. There is a maximum email size. I happen to know that my email maximum size is 20,000. I want to make sure convert images to JPEG is clicked because sometimes, you know, obviously if you're gonna send a raw or a, a TIFF file, certainly the raw files, they're, they're just not gonna make it by email very often and they need to be converted and converting it to a JPEG and making it smaller is definitely an advantage. We'll check out JPEG compression options. Uh, a lot of these we, we don't have to worry about so much, but uh, quality, between 80 and 90. 80 will make it a little bit smaller. It's hard to tell the difference between 80 and 90. I would, I would go with 80 over an email, unless it's gotta be keeper for some reason, and if you're sending it by email, it's not a keeper, right? And then lastly, reduce large images, especially like my JPEGs straight out of my camera or a, a RAW, they're gonna be like on a 9,500 by 5,400 or something, it's like huge, huge files. We, we don't need that sent to an email. Either a 19 by 20 or by 1080, uh, those numbers are for like an HD display or what is it, 3960 by, no, 2160, 3980 by 2160 is optimized for a 4K display, that's uh, ultra HD. And if we size everything down to that as a maximum size, then we're making smaller emails. They're gonna look great quality even on a, on a screen like this. Apply that, I click send. Send is now going to launch Outlook. If you don't have Outlook set up in some way, that might be a stall for you. You'll notice down in my bottom right corner, there we go, I click on Outlook. There's my two images, they're sized, ready to go. I'm just gonna send it to myself. Alec Watson at me.com. Oh man, I just shared my email with everybody. Are you guys gonna send me stuff? Uh, subject, pictures. Spelt wrong. Because <laughs> I, can't, I can't do anything at the same time and type. Super easy and finished on email. That is how we send via email. Uh, there is another way that I think is cooler because sometimes we wanna, we wanna share a whole bunch of images. Let me scroll down to, let's see. I've got all these wall haircuts that my barber friends did. And let's say I wanted to share all of these with a bunch of them, there we go. That's a lot of photos. That's probably not going to go well into an email and I wanna to send to multiple people. So one of the other options is this send pics option. And this is an ACDC option that is like a free piece of software. You know, the very first time you click this, you're going to have to sign up. I've clicked on multiple images. They're currently all being sized and optimized and uploaded to a server where they can be shared. I think this is an awesome way to be able to share multiple photos with people. Now, unlike an email, these are gonna be housed online. And this is a service done by ACDC that I just happen to think is pretty darn awesome. And from here, I can, I'll just send it to myself again, Alec Watson at me.com. And I will call this wall haircuts for my barber friends, rather than me sharing my, their emails <laughs> on a public video. So then what happens is this will become an online album, which I can either view 
or download. And so I can see it on my phone, I can download it to a computer. This is a fantastic way built in to, well, I guess it's not exactly built into ACDC, but ACDC makes this piece of software. All you gotta do is the first time you click on that, if you don't have it, you'll have to download it, install it, and then you have this process of send pics. And I think that is a fabulous service. And again, you're not gonna find that from the Adobe guys or Capture One or any of the other uh, pieces of software that, you know, that, that sometimes I use for different clients. So full marks to ACDC for this one. That's how, that's how I share my images. If you've got questions on that, you know what? I would drop, make sure you join the online community and drop your questions in there. It's a fantastic place to learn more about ACDC and learn about how people are using it. But that is my go-to. In number, number 10, in video 10, in video 10 next, we're going to take a final look at making sure that all your data is backed up, your photos are backed up, and you know how to do it. And at that point, you are off to a pretty solid start.